Hey guys, it's Gabriella and welcome back to another scary text message story. Today we're going to be playing Dead Sisters. You can't stop them coming, just pray you can send them back. <laughs> Look, this sounds so spooky. Let's jump right in and see what's going to happen. Marlin, there's a girl on my TV. What the heck? <laughs> I think I've seen that movie. It's not a movie. She's on every channel. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Maybe it's a cool advertising campaign. Can you check your cable channels? Sure. Nothing. My TV show is showing the usual. The girl's lips are moving. What's she saying? I can't hear her. Just white noise. Like when the TV isn't tuned in properly. It's like she's looking right at me, Willow. Turn it off. It's freaky. OMG. It is off. What the heck? Is this, is this TV haunted? No way. What's she doing now? She's climbing out of the screen! So you are watching that movie. Willow? <laughs> now is not the time! Marlin? What is- <laughs> Jenny! Can you come around my house? Not right now, I'm washing my hair. Marlin's with me. Something's happened, Jenny. Ooh, it sounds very mysterious. You won't believe it. Try me, but be quick. <laughs> I need to rinse. Actually, I got that deep conditioner in. A girl came out of my TV. I've seen that movie. It wasn't a movie. I left her in my house. I called my mom, but she thinks I'm joking too. What did you expect? A little bit of trust? That honestly is one of my biggest fears is like something happening like this, but nobody believing you because it just seems so unrealistic. OMG, did the girl have blonde hair? Yes. I believe you. Oh no, she's in Jenny's TV too. What's changed your mind? This. Oh, she's in the mirror. Get out of there. What the heck? What is going on? Jenny, move. Please tell me you got away. I made it outside. Okay, I'm coming around to your house too, Willow. No. What if she comes here too? Guys. Harry, don't tell me you've seen her too. Seen who? Wait, how did Harry get in this group chat? I thought Harry was the one. Okay, Marlon is the guy who started this. A creepy girl? No, Jenny hasn't come over today. <laughs> You're hilarious, Harry. <laughs> Funny, unless you mean her. <laughs> what is happening? My mom must have put this up this morning. She's so weird. Oh, it's like a picture. So she's in everything? You've got to get rid of it. I thought it was a bad photo of my cousin Mandy. No, it's got some sort of power. We're serious, Harry. Whoa, did she just wink at me? <laughs> so is the picture what started all of this? Like Harry got this creepy picture and now it's haunting all of us? Probably. She climbed out of my TV and out of my mirror. What? I've taken it out of the frame. Gonna burn it. Good, that's all I was gonna say. I was gonna say burn it. <laughs> Be careful with that fire, Harry. This can't be happening. She's laughing. What the heck? No, she's in every photograph around the house. What? Look, how is she doing this? I am so... OMG. She's in the room. Get out of there, Harry. I can't. She's between me and the door. Jenny, where have you been, Willow? I've been sitting in church all day. Did you see anything strange? You mean like a girl climbing out of the church projector screen? That's exactly what I mean. Then no, it's been quiet. But I spoke to Father Thomas. Did you tell him what's been happening? I even showed him the pictures. Excellent, what did he say? He says his nephew made pictures on Photoshop too. My parents were the same way. Marlon's dad grounded him for two weeks. Why would he do that? He said he broke the TV playing his silly prank. So we're on our own? At least no one's seen the girl again. Maybe she just wanted to scare us? That's what's so confusing. Why you guys and not me? We've been best friends for three years now. If a ghost wanted to frighten you guys, surely she'd want to spook me too. Is Willow seriously feeling left out of being hot? <laughs> girl, this is not a problem you want to have. We're in the same classes. We go to movies together, shop at the malls every Saturday, and used to play board games together. I think I know what's happening. 
Do they have a Ouija board? Okay guys, I'm back home. Did you find it? I've set it up in front of me. But we haven't done a Ouija board since we were 12. That is why you don't play with Ouija boards. And nothing really happened when we did. I can't even remember what it spelled out. I remember exactly what it said. Three dead sisters. <gasps> so the girl's not one person, it's three? <gasps> That's right. Willow panicked and flipped the board. So it's not one girl after all. It's three. And we never sent them away. It's taken them nearly two years to get to us. But they got here in the end. What do you think they want? I borrowed a book from the library. It has everything we need to know. Secrets of the Ouija board. <laughs> It says the board must be closed properly. Oh my gosh. The board must be closed properly or the spirit will remain between worlds. A lost spirit will eventually gravitate towards the plane of the dead, although powerful spirits may seek to... To, <laughs> to haunt... Oh wait. To re-enter the world of the living. <laughs> That's comforting. <gasps> or the spirit can come back into the world of the living. But why would they scare us like this? It says three times out of four, a Ouija board will contact a bad spirit. What have you done, Willow? What has Willow done? Excuse me. You're talking about something that happened over a year ago. I haven't finished. The more dangerous it is, the further it has to travel. It says it can take spirits years to appear to the player. It was you who flipped the board, Willow. Maybe only you can send them back. But you need to be quick. Okay, I feel like this shouldn't all be Willow's fault. Like, we all agreed to play the game, did we not? I think it's too late. <laughs> no. It's never too late. I don't know what to do. Stay calm, Willow. Put the pointer on the board. Wait, Willow. <laughs> the sisters are here. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Stay away from that thing. Who are you? We are the dead sisters, you fool. Where are you? I'm standing at your front door. I'm in your kitchen. Wait, there needs to be one more. And I'm in your closet. Quick, Willow, put your hand on the pointer. Speak to the spirits. I don't know what to say. How about just go away? I close the spirit door. <gasps> say their names, then command them to leave. Don't you dare. It's not working, and the closet door is shaking! Say goodbye! Send them home! Let us in! OMG! <laughs> what is happening? Did you do it? Have they gone? I can't see them. Only one way to find out if it worked. Open the closet, Willow. Really? Okay. Here it goes. <laughs> okay, we good? We good? There's no one in the closet? It's empty. Yes, you did it! Wait a minute. No, the Ouija board is moving. What does it say? V, I, N, C, E, N, T. Who's Vincent? They must have had a brother. <laughs> And I just heard my front door slam shut. Has Vincent left the house? Or has he come in? Use the board. Tell him to leave. I can't. Why? The Ouija board is on fire. I can't believe it was one year ago today. Since what? Since we sent the sisters back to where they belong. Oh my God. Vincent is going to come for them. Don't be so insensitive, Jenny. You're in a group chat, remember? Sorry, I forgot. What? <laughs> How are you, Vincent? What? Wait, what? <laughs> My head is broken. I can't compute what's happening. I'm fine, thank you, Jenny. I agree my sisters weren't very nice, but like Barbara Stoker said in her book, and three out of four spirits contacted through a Ouija board are bad. One of the four is good. Are you coming out tonight, Vincent? Sure, Willow, but please, can we go somewhere different? Just because I'm a ghost doesn't mean I want to hang out at the graveyard every night. <laughs> so Vincent was the fourth sibling 
fighting of the three dead sisters and they were bad and he was good and they just kept him around as like their new BFF. Oh my gosh, this was so good. Still do not recommend playing with Ouija boards, but if you guys enjoyed this as much as I did, make sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe so you don't miss a single video. Let me know what you thought of this video down below in the comments and make sure to follow me on Instagram so we can hang out in between uploads. If you want to be entertained until next time, check out the videos I have for you on screen. I'll see you later for another scary text message story. Bye!